Hello, this is Mugen Lure here, and welcome to Mugen TV News. And just a few days ago, Nintendo had surprised us with another mini partner direct a day after the PlayStation 5 live stream event. This mini direct had given us a bit of an insight in what we can expect from third party developers heading into 2021. For starters, we were greeted with a new entry into the Monster Hunter series with Monster Hunter Rise. It was only a matter of time that Capcom would grace a Nintendo Switch with a true next gen Monster Hunter experience. Locations are now integrated into one seamless map and players will be able to traverse mountaintops with their lasso bug like creature that will create pretty epic moments on your monster hunter adventure not only that players will now be able to ride and fight alongside a new dog like companion that will farther immerse you in this new world of monster hunter expect the game to release march 26 2021 Catcom was not finished delivering Monster Hunter news though. They continue with the announcement of a JRPG story focused Monster Hunter game called Monster Hunter Story 2. This series is a non-traditional Monster Hunter game that will capture more of an anime aesthetic than the mainline series from Monster Hunter games. It was also a follow up to a Nintendo 3DS Monster Hunter game. We will find out more details on this title next year but we can expect a release window of summer 2021. Well. It looks like Disgaea fans have something to look forward to with the announcement of Disgaea 6, Defiance of Destiny. If you are actually into tactical RPGs with a layer of depth and complexity, then this is the game for you. And I also believe that this is the first Disgaea game that ha actually has 3D character models as well. And expect a summer 2021 release window. And Rune Factory fans will be happy to hear that Rune Factory 5 game is slated for a 2021 release window. This popular game series has been around for quite a long time now. It is a combination of life simulation and dungeon crawling JRPG that will satisfy fans of both genres. If you haven't tried a Rune Factory game, then the fifth installment would definitely be an opportunity to give the series a chance. From the creators of Nights into Dreams, they had decided to work with Square Enix to release a potential predecessor to the Night series called Balan Wonderworld. It was first announced for the Xbox Series X, but we now know it's definitely coming to the Nintendo Switch March 26, 2021. The game features a male and female protagonist who enters various different worlds and gain over 80 different costumes that possess magical abilities in order to traverse the Wonderlands. The Nintendo Switch announcement of the game features two-player co-op that allow players to play with two Joy-Cons for couch co-op play. And of course, Nintendo had to show off a few indie games that will pretty much be ready and available at Nintendo eShop for those who are interested in something quick and fun to play while on the go. Last but not least, Xbox Studios announced that Ori and the Will of the Wisps is now available for purchase on the eShop and for those who are interested in a physical copy of the game for a limited time you can pre-order a special box set that includes art book and two physical copies of Ori and much more and I must say it's a beautiful box set even though it's not my kind of game I would just pretty much buy it just for the box art alone and well that pretty much wraps today's Mugen TV news and if you enjoy this video then feel free to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified for when I upload new videos to the channel. This is Mugen Lord signing off. See you game fiends later. Peace out. It looks like you reached the end of the video. Well while you're at it check out some of my other discussion videos by clicking on the annotations below. And don't forget to follow me on other social media platforms to stay up to date with future content. Signing off.